Ben Florentino here at West Coast Marine, Parker Booth, and Camus Boats. Hey, I'm going to give you a quick tour of my new 2024 Camus 26 HP. Hey, starting up in the bow, uh, Ben Coda Instinct, 36 volt, 72 inch shaft. Got your anchor locker here. Put about 400 yards of rope and then your rope. Then we got your next first storage up, up in the bow. You see how much space you have. So you can use it for either fish hold or storage. Right now we just have life jackets, backup uh, Minn Kota foot pedal, got some fillet stuff, got safety items, and just miscellaneous stuff in here. Underneath here is the tray for my three Norsk lithium batteries. Okay, and then moving off that. And you can see it's got padding all the way around, including the backrest. But these all come off. Yep, they all come off. You just slide it out, store it in there, good to go. Put it back in. There you go. And then stepping over here behind you, we have first of storage. You can see how much storage is in there. We've got about 11 boxes. Three thirty-seven hundreds. This lane is equipment. Uh, next, on both sides, port and starboard, we have rod lockers. Six rods each on each side. And again, these are lockable. You could use this as a five-gallon bucket, ice, um, a fish hole, um, backup fuel. The boat holds ninety gallons of fuel. And we have more doors open. This cooler here you can use as your kind of like put a little ice block in there and hold sandwiches, fruit, whatever it may be. It's uh, 24 gallons. We'll step around this way. T-top JL audio speakers on uh, four speakers on the top and then we have two eight inch subwoofers on the, each side. And the sound sounds like this. And that's all and that's all controlled by JL Audio Sound System head unit, which is down here. And then up on the dash here we have two Hummingbird Solex 12s. Five-inch uh, vessel view, Mercury vessel view. Uh, lighting, you can see all the lighting here for the boat. And then the, the uh, star feature is this new zip wake system that keeps navigation or the boat stable. It, it's basically trim tabs electrical. Okay. Then you have storage here. Phones, wallets, whatever it be. Nice helm pad by uh, Gator Step, the uh, famous logo. More storage, more storage but under the seats. This boat is still new, so every, these pop up, open up. You could store, I store this, the uh, covers in here for the electronics. And these bolsters, you can see, really comfortable. They fold down if you want to sit, and you can pop them back up. When you're running, as a backrest here. Three-way glass at the helm. Okay, and stepping back um, over this way. You have four rod holders on each side, port and starboard. Then you have the, uh, the door opens it. We have uh, this is a potty you can macerate. And the cool thing about these uh, rod holders, you have this opening here, so the rods fit right through there, along with this. Gives you more, eight more rods. Nice, okay. And coming back to the stern, there is four rod holders here, two cup holders. We have storage 
in here. I keep my magic erasers, you know, cutters, backup uh, leader, clips, D hooker. You can set it up any way you want. This is how I have it for now. Just trying to figure it out. There's a frigid, rigid uh, cooler there. And more storage. You have a seat that folds up. You've got six, six, seven. And then this actually pulls out. So you can look, service your uh, bilge area. Seat folds down, so now you have a casting platform here. 35, 35 gallon live well on the port, on the starboard side here. And there's another one on the port side here. These open up. And again, notice the detail on the screws. No, no protruding screws. Got a plate here, protected. And you also have shock hinges, so it's nice and quiet. And then you have the creme de la creme, Mercury Verado 400. V10. And the boat sits on a custom Camus trailer, LED lighting, four disc brakes, radial tires, custom rims. And that's our Camus 26HB here at Camus Boats West Coast and at West Coast Marine here at Pacific Coast Sport Fishing.